Hello, hello, welcome back to my channel and to another reaction video. This time we'll be continuing the Ruby series. This is episode 5 of volume 3. Never miss a beat. Oh, Penny. <laughs> These two are from uh, Team Garden or whatever. And victory goes to Penny and Sierra of Atlas! Thank you for a wonderful time. The other girl is just there to take time, I guess. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ruby. Ruby Rose, 15, hails from Patch, leader of Team Ruby. Status, questionable. So, Penny, you two were incredible out there. How do you keep control of all those swords? It's so cool. Penny, I believe it is best if we move on to our next location. Could we have just a minute to talk? She is there to measure time. Your hmm. friend, or well, in a way, she's like Blake. But if Blake was ordered to spend time with you, oh, so wise. Precisely. <laughs> does she know about? You know, beep boop bop does not compute. Oh no, General Ironwood doesn't really want anyone to know. There was an incident with a magnet, but I was able to play it off. Okay. <laughs> Ruby, there's something I've been wanting to talk to you about. I want to stay at Beacon. Penny, they'll never let you do that. I know, but I oh. have a plan. It's been precisely one minute, ma'am. I'll talk to you more soon, Ruby. Our next match will begin in 15 minutes. Oh my gosh, that's right, it's time for... Well, now it's our turn. Just remember to keep proper form. All right. You're from Atlas. What can we expect? Well, seeing as their kingdom, academy, and armed forces are all merged as one, I think we can expect strict, militant fighters with advanced technology and carefully rehearsed strategy. Or not, I guess. Or whatever they are. <laughs> You wife's me, right? The heiress. I am. I take you're pretty good with us then. I do my best. Yeah, my dad was good too. Owned a little dust shop of his own. Till your father's company ran him out of business. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Sure you are. Hey, why don't you? Hey, why don't you? That's what you sound like. Uh, hey, where'd you get your hair extensions? 
This is just oh, my normal hair. Oh, don't don't touch the hair. Really? Yeah. Is that a problem? You should try rollerblading sometime. It's super fun. It'd probably take you a while though, since you're so you know top heavy. Okay, we're going Excuse there. Excuse me. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, here we go. One. Begin! That money can't buy you skill. Herself to take out Flint. Wait a minute. What's this? Oh, no shit. And gentlemen, Flint Cole remains standing. Damn. You did it, Flint. Don't worry about her. She's easy. But kind of annoying. Ooh, Yang's gonna kick like their ass now. Angry. And you would like her when she's <laughs> upset. <laughs> Ah, 
damn, that was good. Weiss! Weiss, are you okay? <coughs> I may not be singing for a while. You know, I'm not sure that was proper form. Oh, ha ha. <laughs> Sometime, right, Flip? That was a gutsy move, Schnee. Okay. I dig it. Good job, you two. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what? Oh, nothing. We're just going to be making a slight mm, alteration to the plan. Oh dear. What does that mean? It means that this will be even easier than we thought. Oh no, what, what are they gonna do to Penny? You know, he's making you look like a fool. His heart is in the right place. He's just misguided. Sometimes I'm not even sure he has a heart. So... Have you chosen your guardian yet? Maidens choose themselves. I simply believe I found the right candidate. Ever since the day I met her, I had a feeling she would be the one. She's strong, intelligent, caring. But most importantly, she's ready. Uh, uh, okay. There you have it folks, never miss a beat, and yeah, I guess that's uh, the theme of the fight also. But yeah, that, that was a pretty, pretty damn good fight. Team Funky was awesome, and yeah, they, especially the, um, I don't think they mentioned, okay, Flint was the guy, but this uh, Rollo Lighting Chick in here, I don't think they mentioned her name, or they did, I just missed it. <laughs> but anyway, she did a fine job getting under Yang's skin, but it wasn't enough. Best part of, of the fight was when Yang pushed through Flint's that uh, trumpet of his this attack and just punched him and finished him off. <laughs> that was a cool shot. But yeah. Now the bad guys, I saw you, you could see that Cinder was having in her, her little, little hand computer thing, she was checking Penny's uh, design, so I'm a little concerned for her. But yeah, also Penny, I'd be... Uh, hmm. I mean, I would have expected, a, I'm not sure if I remember correctly, but the, the team that Penny and the other uh, girl were fighting, they were team members of Carden's team. I'm just wondering why the hell wouldn't, wouldn't Carden be the kind of guy who would choose himself to, you know, advance? I don't know. I don't know if we we're uh, even <laughs> getting Garden back, that uh, story arc was finished, but I don't know. But yeah, now at the end, Hirair is coming to Aspin and Crow, so some truth will be revealed, hopefully next episode. <laughs> but yeah, great episode, uh, great music. What do you guys think? Write your thoughts down below. Hope you enjoyed my next video. Comment, drop a like, subscribe. If you want to know, I will see you in another video. Bye.